Hello, good morning viewers. Here is yet another words problem question for the kids, though it is a great level mathematics. The question reads, Tambol was asked to subtract 1 from a certain number and divide the result by the number. Unfortunately, he subtracted the number from 1 and divided by the number. The answer he got was 1 less than expected and we are asked to find the number. Uh, let us represent the information mathematically. Uh, we have two information here. Uh, let us first of all use what was asked. So Tumble was asked to subtract one from a certain number. So let that number be x. So he was asked to subtract one from that number and still divide by the number. But what he does was he subtracted the number from 1. So he said 1 minus the number and still divided by that number. But the question is telling us, you can see it here, the answer he got was 1 less than expected. So this number right here is 1 less than this one. So if we should add 1 to this number, they will be equivalent. So we can directly add 1 to this number. And equate them. All right, now we have our equation. But not that x can never be equal to zero. Now what we are going to do here, we are going to multiply every single term by x in order to clear the fraction. So we multiply the whole of this by x. So this x will cancel this to x, and it has to multiply this by x. So what we have here is x minus 1 equal to 1 minus x plus 1 multiplied by x is x. From here, these two x's cancel. Uh, we have x minus 1 equal to 1. We add 1 to both sides. We have x equal to 1 plus 1. And finally, you can see that x is equal to 2. So x equal to 2 is our solution. But we can test it in the main equation to see whether it is true. Um, you can see what we have here is x minus 1 divided by x. If x is equal to 2, we have 2 minus 1 equal to 1 divided by 2 is a half. So here we have 1 over 2. And here we have 1 minus 2 is negative 1 divided by 2. You can see we have a negative 1 over 2. But we have plus 1 here. If you add 1 here, you're going to get 1 over 2. So the left-hand side is 1 over 2 and the right-hand side is 1 over 2. And hence, we say that the real solution is x equal to positive 2. And this is all I have for you today. Thank you for watching. Do share to your learning colleagues. And don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel for more exciting videos. Bye-bye.